السلام علیکم مائی ڈیئر اسٹوڈنٹس بسم اللہ الرحمن رحیم ٹوڈے مائی لیکچر از اباؤٹ دی میجرمنٹ آف ٹونیسٹی سو ایز ان پریویس لیکچرس وی ہیو آلریڈی تھاک اباؤٹ دی آل دی پیرامیٹرز آف واٹ از آئیسوٹونک سولوشنس ہائپوٹونک اینڈ ہائپوٹونک سولوشنس سو مائی سیکنڈ لیکچر از اباؤٹ دی میجرمنٹ آف ٹونیسٹی سو ہاؤ وی کین میجر دی ٹونیسٹی آف ڈیفرینٹ سولوشنس so uh, it will be discussed uh, today uh, okay so the tonicity of solutions it may be determined by uh, one of the following two methods so there are two methods which are used to determine the tonicity of the solution the first one is you can this is what hemolytic method and the second one is cooling get your method and hemolytic hemolytic method this is the first method which we are going to perform uh, the acting principle of this method is the observation of the effect of various solution of drugs on the appearances of the red blood cells suspended and those solutions let's suppose if there is no change in the size and shape of the rbc red blood cell when it is dipped or immersed and test solution on the observings with microscope then the solution is said to be isotonic with the blood so this point is uh, clear that uh, let's suppose if the rbc of the red blood cell when they are suspended and the solution and when there is no change occur in the shape and size of the red blood cell when they are immersed in the test solutions which are observed uh, and the with the help of microscope and then at uh, then uh, then this solution will be isotonic to the blood when will be the when the solution will be isotonic when there is no change occur in the size in the shape of rbc if they are dipped in the test solution and then it can be observed with microscope so after that these conditions are possible uh, the second one is this method uh, can be made more accurate by using a hematocrit which is called pcv packed cell volume uh after that uh, centrifugation can be done which is centrifuge head and with the graduated capillary tube it is held in each of the two arms uh so uh, it means uh it means we are going to uh, we are going to perform uh, this uh, work experimentally and inshallah then i will show in my uh, next videos look at here uh, this is the uh, you can say this is the uh, procedures this is the procedure how you can perform the hemolytic methods so first of all uh, initially uh, we will take a capillary tube uh, which is called tube a so one capillary tube a it is filled with blood the tube a capillary tube it is filled with the blood and it should be diluted with 5 ml of 0.9 percent weight by volume in a cl isotonic solution the solution must be isotonic so it means that it should be diluted with 5 ml of 0.9 percent you know what does it mean 0.9 percent weight by volume in a cl so what does it mean so it means that uh, you can say 9 gram 9 gram of uh, weight by volume in a cl should be taken the other capillary tube tube b the tube b it is filled with the blood and it should be diluted with an equal volume as the standard which is taken here for example 5 ml of test solution 5 ml this is your test solution now uh then uh both the tubes mean tube a and tube b so they they will be centrifugation will be done. so they are centrifuge are rotated at a high speed after that after centrifugation the blood cells they are concentrated at the one end of the capillary tubes and the volume occupied by the cells for example pet cell volume is myers Finally the PCV of the test solution tube tube B it is compared with the PCV of isotonic solution tube tube A and the following reference they are made what will be the results
these are the results a pcv packed cell volume hematocrit of the test solution tube b is same as that of tube a then the test solution is regarded as isotonic if the packed cell volume of the test solution tube b is same as that of tube a then you can say uh, the test solution is regarded as isotonic if the red blood cell volume pcv packed cell volume of the tube is more than that of the tube a then the test solution is regarded as hypotonic look at the difference if the rbc volume for example uh, packed cell volume of the tube is more than that of tube a so here we, we will compare the tube and tube v so the uh, test solution is regarded as hypotonic solution and increase in pcv is due to swelling of red blood cells so as we have discussed with chakra in case of hypotonic solution if the rbc red blood cell volume for example pcv packed cell volume of the tube is less than that of tube a so the test solution is regarded as hypertonic solution and there here in this case there will be a decrease in the pcv pack cell volume what due to shrinkage of rbc which occurs in case of hypertonic solution so these are the results